Well, tonight, Newsom's $76 billion budget surplus plan isn't sitting well with everyone, including some Democratic lawmakers. CBS 13 political expert Gary Dietrich joins us now with his take on all of this. So, Gary, what are some Democrats asking for? Well, you know, Elizabeth, well, you think with a $76 billion surplus, everything would be all happy, happy, but it's not. In fact, Democratic leaders in the health committees in both the Senate and the Assembly have said, for example, that a $200 million request by local public health departments has been ignored. So they've been pushing heavily for that. And there's other things like that. Because right now, with a surplus, some of the things that were cut or were left out over the budget for a number of years you know, are in high demand. And those are the kind of things that uh, Newsom is hearing from members of his own party. Yeah, everybody wants a piece of it. And now Newsom is also getting some backlash from the legislative analyst's office, we know, saying that the budget surplus isn't actually $76 billion, but only about half of that. But do they have any power to actually affect these plans? Tell us about that. Yeah, well, Elizabeth, what that's really about is the fact that a number of uh, increases in surplus dollars are owed to various categories constitutionally, for example, schools through Prop 98. So those are the kind of things that the ledge analyst has said, you know, you really don't have all of that to spend as you'd like. About half of that is already guaranteed to these various other categories. So that's what the dispute about, not about how much actually is above what was projected, but where it's required to go. All right, a lot to sort out. We appreciate your time as always. Thanks, Gary.